I'm sure that 99.9% .9 of you read the description. So yeah, I played Minecraft with RTX settings on, and let me tell you what, it was beautiful. Okay, it was beautiful. Yeah, you know what? With that being said, I mean, if you want to see more content, make sure you follow my uh, my page. This was Chrome Viper. See y'all in the next one. I'm just joking, guys. <laughs> All right, so this is a follow-up to the video I did prior where I unboxed my PC and I briefly played Minecraft with RTX settings on. But yeah, you know, I don't want to keep you all around uh, for two minutes long in an intro. So uh, let's get to it. All right, so we're at Minecraft's world screen. We'll go ahead and create a new world. Um, one that has the RTX feature already active on it. Let's, what do we got? You know what, let's go ahead and do Crystal Palace. Create this world. Everything's fine. We'll just go ahead and start that one right up. Oh, yeah, you're gonna already see it. You can already see it. Now, for those of you that, you know, you've never played Minecraft, you're not Minecraft fans, and it probably doesn't look much to you, but for us who have played it, you know, vanilla, know what it's supposed to look like normally, you can see it right off the bat. I mean, you can already kind of see the god rays from the sun. This definitely nice like you would never have the glare from the water before I don't think I'm in create mode yet I'm not so but you can see there's definitely some like a little bit of 3d added to the blocks now you can see it on the wood yeah there's definitely like some some sort of 3d going on it is nice looking though when Nvidia showcased RTX on it showed the water completely looking like water now this kind of still looks like Minecraft water, but with like a texture overlay on top of it where it's got reflective surfaces. I mean, it still looks good, but it's not exactly what I was expecting. But uh, let's go ahead and see what it looks like underwater. <laughs> that is a very big difference. What is hitting me? Oh my, okay, yeah, I'm gonna get out of here. Yeah, I died. But yeah, look at that though. There is a god ray shining in through the spawn room. I mean, that is freaking nice. And if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, let's go ahead into the settings and I'll turn off RTX just so you can see what I'm talking about. So direct ray tracings, turn that off and you're gonna see the drastic difference. So that is Minecraft normally. This is it. This is vanilla Minecraft right here. All right, so let's go back into our settings and turn RTX back on new. Settings, advanced video, and you want to do direct ray tracing. Look at that. That is like a huge improvement, bro. That's freaking amazing. I'm gonna go out here and see what that looks like. Look at it now. I'm gonna go back to regular Minecraft. Look at that. That is freaking wild. It looks completely different. It looks entirely different. It, it honestly is almost like I'm playing a different game. Like it adds a lot more haze to the world. It, it just looks, I mean, it's Minecraft, so it's weird to say this, but it looks a lot more realistic than, uh, than what Minecraft, you know, what we're used to. I mean, it, just look at the rays underwater. That is wild. That definitely is nice. I, I'm digging that a lot. All right, so this is actually, this is actually my first time playing Minecraft in over a year, just because I'm gonna be honest, I got a little bored with it. Um, even with everything they were adding in at the time, it just, I don't know, for me, it got a little stale. And then when Dungeons came out, that really ruined Minecraft for me because Dungeons was basically everything I wanted Minecraft to be. And it was action packed. It had, you know, new animations, new weapons, new armor, new mobs and better music in my opinion. Now, a lot of a lot of people are gonna give me hate for that one, but uh, yeah, I definitely prefer how they did dungeons. But you know, with this, this is nice. This is basically kind of what dungeons did to Minecraft as far as the visuals go. Like, dungeons was a lot cleaner looking than regular Minecraft. And like, you had wind and the trees would blow in the wind and all, and it looked a lot nicer. You had god rays and reflective surfaces. Let's go inside of this castle and see what it looks like. <laughs> Look at the water. That water is like crystal clear. That's crazy. I mean, it's still got your like little pixel animations in it. You can see it. 
but I mean, let, let me let me switch real quick just so you guys can see. Normally the water in Minecraft is like blue and it kind of looks like crap. This is a big improvement. You see what I'm talking about? Look at that, that's freaking wild. It is like completely different. Dude, this is, this is nice. I would totally play Minecraft again. This is freaking awesome. But I mean, just look at the difference. It is freaking wild. It's almost like I'm playing an entirely different game. Like this is, this is freaking awesome. I love it. Like this gets me for excited for Minecraft again. Like I, I would love to get a group of people playing. I remember playing back on the uh, the 360. I had like 10 friends I'd play Minecraft with constantly. Oh my God. All I did was play Minecraft and Halo Reach. I mean, those were the days fresh out of high school and I got a freaking spider chasing me. Ooh, nope. Nope. I probably, uh, I don't even think I can change the settings for this. It's kind of just a pre-made world. Oh no. You actually kind of gave me a little boost there. Now let's go up. Let's see what's up here. Nope. Man, look at that. There's even a reflection from the freaking ladder on the wall. And even like, there's a shimmer on the stuff. Dude, this is insane. This continues to blow my mind. This just, it gets better and better. <laughs> Guys, I need to change my pants right now. I'll be right back. All right, so I went ahead and changed my pants. So now I, I went and started up a new map as well. This is actually the RTX egg hunt map that uh, Mojang has on their store. So <laughs> it just looks so nice. Uh, let's exit this cave and go find some freaking eggs. Gillis, I am not used to Minecraft looking this way. This is freaking just, oh. I don't really know where to go though. How do I get out of here? I can't break anything. What the f- How do I get out of here? Yeah, I'm still trying to find my way out of this freaking cave. I, uh, I don't know where to go. This is, um, a little confusing, I guess. Two hours later. All right, so I went ahead and uh, got all prepped up with my wife's headset. Uh, this is not mine, guys. This is not mine. Don't judge me. So uh, the official story is that my dog chewed up my headset. But yeah, so actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and start up another world. Um, which is the color light and shadow RTX. It's a better showcase of mine Minecraft in RTX. Basically, it shows you all the different like rooms and textures that you can have in the game. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and start that one up, and we'll see uh, we'll see what that one looks like. There we are. Okay, what is this? What is is that water? I don't know what I did. I broke water, and it's not. It doesn't look like it's ice. Oh wait, what the heck? What? Oh no. All right, I think I just got stuck down here, guys. Uh, yeesh. All right, I'm gonna have to go uh, start a new world. All right, there we go, we're back. Um, but yeah, that looks nice. Uh, regardless, let's, uh, let's go over here, let's see what, I think these are like portals to different zones. Yes, this is it. I briefly saw this online from another another YouTuber, but dude, look at this. Look at those graphics. I mean, it's reflecting in the glass, the lights on the ceiling. That is like huge for Minecraft. Look at this fish tank though. Oh my God, this is showing my house up. Wait, what? Is that like a terrarium or something? Oh yeah, it is because it's bamboo. Okay. Let me out. Oops. Oh, I must be in creative. I'm in creative. I didn't have to restart the world. I'm in creative. Are you kidding me? This guy's got moves on him though. Look at him. Go. Oh, holy sh. This dude, he's just like, I don't care who's watching. I'm just doing my thing. Don't mind that guy over there. But yeah, I think that's about it for the, uh, the uh, fish tank room. It looks freaking gorgeous, but... Let's go back to the lobby and see. See something else. Okay, let's. Global illumination. Check this one out. Same thing as last room. Oh no. What's happening?
All right, guys, so that's gonna be about it for this video. Um, I don't wanna go on and make a 20 minute long video about you know the same stuff over and over again. Hopefully, you know, you at least found this video entertaining. If you did, then please consider smacking that like and subscribe button as it helps boost me up in the YouTube algorithm, especially if you wanna see more content like this. With that being said, y'all have a good one as always. Stay sweet.